<laughs> and I didn't take any notes. Um, I didn't take any notes. All you have to do is stay a minute. Just take your time. The clock is ticking, so stay. All you have to do is stay. What's up, guys? Lockout Man here in the truck. And I am back with the first make the call video. What's going on? I don't know if I should change the name from Lockout Men Makes the Call to just being call videos. I don't know. I'll probably figure it out along the way. So it was suggested in one of the comments that I would call Transport America. Which I did. I got a chance to talk to Dennis. Now, the first time I called, I didn't have the recorder on and it was just, ugh, it was messed up. But then when I called him back and, and talked to him again, I got some good information. He sent me some information. So if you guys are interested in Transport America or anything like that, I do have the information and I will be happy to forward it to you guys. Hit me up at lockoutmen at gmail.com and I will forward it to you. I will forward his information that that he given me so that you guys can get with him on the lease side. You guys send me suggestions to call whoever you guys want me to call. Be sure to just, how can I say it? Be sure to just be specific to who you want me to call, right? Don't just send me any old body. Don't just say, hey, lockout men, call such and such, call such and such, call such and such. Give me a background on the company to call. Don't just say, hey, lockout men, just call them or call that or call whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to do these call videos catering to you guys. You see what I'm saying? It's not about me anymore because right now I'm comfortable where I'm at. You see what I'm saying? But if you guys want to know about such and such company, such and such company, such and such company, let me know what you want to know about them. All right? The goal for you guys is to do your research and if I can help you in any way possible, I will do that, all right? So definitely subscribe to the channel, all right? Subscribe to the channel, subscribe to the channel. And let me see if I can make something happen for you. And it's like my email. Only got one thing working. My one program runs fine. Mm-hmm. Huh. Isn't that strange? Oh, hang on. Here we go. Let's see if it works now. It does. So, hang on. So, I basically, see with this email. Okay. I've got an email. I think it lines everything. Kathy, I sent this over to her. Let me see what it says. Owner operator overview. It's got the dollars free, empty, and loaded. The load board option. Okay. Fuel surcharge. Okay. Right. right. Our 100% fuel pass-through savings. Right. National pricing on all parts and maintenance items. Mm -hmm. No force dispatch. No force dispatch, okay. We provide the trailer. We provide trailer and cargo insurance. You don't have to write this down. I'm going to send it to you. Okay. Base plate and permit bonus plan. Your The things that the owner-operator is responsible for, okay? Okay. So I'm going to file. I'm going to file. I'm going to send this over to you. Okay. So what are yeah. what what are what what are some of the what are some of the stuff that the uh, that the that the lease uh, that the lease is responsible for? You already mentioned that when we talked before that we we don't get uh, we don't get empty miles. Well, you do if you're on the dispatch side. Okay. But not on the load board. Not on the load board. Okay. And yeah. as you said about the dispatch, the difference between the dispatch and the uh, and the low board is that the dispatch uh, we do get empty miles, but we 
but the dispatchers will choose what loads to give you but you will have the option to uh to turn it down if 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 it's not feasible to you right yes okay dollar three yep. per mile on all miles right yep okay okay so uh me. the truck uh the truck govern you mentioned the truck is governed that for the lease is 68 65 oh 60 68 i'm sorry 68, 68 no 68 i'm sorry yeah 68 for the uh for the lease and 63 to 65 for the company yes okay and payment um so what's the weekly payments for the lease trucks i'm gonna say six i'll say 620 and be a little high okay 620 and as you said before uh i'm writing this down so as you said before um mm -hmm. that this is not a walk away yeah the, well, we're, it's we're, not a, we don't classify it as a walk away i i but we're not gonna chase you okay okay um we would i think what makes it different with transport america um that Sean, you and I are talking, we're going to talk about our program. You and I are going to have to agree you're going to come in and be successful. Okay. Because if I think you're going to come in and be a three-month lease operator, I'm going to push out and say, hey, let's do company first. Right. I mean, would I'm be, not, would I'm it, not would paid it be by the truck. Would it, would it be better for, for, any, for any driver that's interested in lease? Would it be better for that particular driver to be a company driver first with that company to see if that company will work out for them? Is is would you say that's I, personal? Just personal opinion. I say yes. Okay. Okay. Unless, 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 <clears throat> if you have experience, right, with owner operator. Okay. Okay. I hire guys that have trucks. They've went out and spent $190,000 on a truck. Mm -hmm. Okay? They're using their own money. Okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And they, come, they call me up and say, Dennis, what do you have to offer? And they know the business. Okay? Right. They know the numbers. We talk about the numbers, and if it's a fit, it's a fit. And they can be very successful walking in the door. So can it, in the same way on the lease side. Right. But people, a lot of time, Sean, when they think about lease, they think, well, I can get home more often, I can make more money, and I can run where I want to run. Right. Yeah, exactly. That's that's what I was. That's not true. That's what I. Now that's what I was thinking. I, I I was thinking that. That's why I'm doing. That's why I'm doing the homework. Cause that's what I was thinking. No, I'm, I'm thinking work that way. right. I'm thinking like okay. <laughs> I'm I'm thinking okay. I got. I'm I'm a lease driver. I got the options to to get home whenever I want, stay out for as long as I want, but get home and stay out for as long as I want at home, and then I will come back, and then I would get. Uh, you know, just free range of just being a lease driver. So you say, and so you say that's that's not the case. Well, it, 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 look at it this way, okay? Mm -hmm. If you de okay, I'm going to say you like to eat, right? Right. Okay. So you open a steakhouse, okay? Okay. And you okay? I'm going to go into I'm going to go into the restaurant business because I'm tired of driving the truck. Right. But you know what? I don't like working weekends, so I think I'll just stay. I'm just going to be open um, Tuesday through Thursday. Okay. Okay, because I, I know I can I can serve a lot of meals in those three days, and I like Fridays off, and I like extended weekends on Monday. Right. Okay. It's a recipe for a disaster, even trying to open a restaurant and not being open on the weekend. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, I see where you're going. I see where you're going. That's, yeah. a, that's a good you analogy. You only make money. You only make money when you're in the truck working. 
and the bills continue. Whether you're in that truck driving it, mm-hmm. okay, or you're sitting at the house looking at it, mm-hmm. okay, mm-hmm. you're still going to have that weekly truck payment. You're still going to have your insurances. Mm-hmm. You know, you're going to have all the expenses, with the exception of fuel and maintenance. Okay. Are the only two bills that stop while you're sitting at the house. Okay. Okay. You know, can you make good money doing this? Yes. But can you lose you can. money? Can you lose money while doing this too? Oh hell yes. I've figured out a way to lose money and everything I've ever done. How about you? <laughs> <laughs> I guess we got. I guess we got to figure out. I guess we, in order to be successful with that, we got to figure out both ways or not. Um, all right. So before I hang up with you, uh, real quick, uh, orientation uh, is it is it the same for lease and company? As you mentioned before, do we get do the lease uh, the people that's interested in lease? Do they get paid for orientation as well? And if so, how much is the orientation? Yes, Your orientation, let me get this up. We just changed that, okay? Okay. We just changed it. So give me one minute. And by the way, this is uh this is a no money down lease. Um Well, your down payment is a thousand dollars. Oh, it is a down payment. Now, oh, okay. Yes, now, whoops, what in the heck did I do there? Don't know. Wow. <laughs> what did I do? Whoops, come on, take my zoom off. Uh-oh, hang on, I just, wow, I don't know what I just did, but I got to do, I got to, yeah. Oh, just take your time, take your time. Yeah, well, I'm not sure what I just did, but you know, it wasn't right. It, it went to uh, being so big on my screen, there was one word on a 32-inch screen. Hmm. So, let's do it this way. Okay, now we currently have, um, for the MinWest program, $5,000 sign-on bonus. It's 500 after first load, 1500 at 60 days, 1500 at 6 months, 1500 at 9 months. Oh, this is the the lease operators can 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 get the uh, sign on bonus as well. Yes, that's it's just for sign on. We just for lease. We don't do it for company. Oh, this is for the le- oh okay. wait, this is sign on bonus for the lease. Do y'all have a sign on bonus for company? No. Okay, but y'all have a sign on bonus for lease drivers. That's interested yes, in the lease. Okay, is it paid out before the before the years out? You just mentioned it. It sounds like it well, is. No, yeah, no, I did. Yeah, five hundred at first load, mm-hmm. fifteen hundred sixty days, fifteen hundred six months. Okay. Fifteen at nine months. Okay. So okay. So how much is that all together? That sounds. You say 15, five grand. 15, oh, five grand. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Now. Um, now you was about to finish uh, you, far, before I cut you off. You was about to go finish about the orientation. <laughs> My fault. <laughs> My bad. I didn't mean to cut you off. I, I was just. I, I was surprised. I was. I was really surprised at the uh, at the sign on bonus for for the lease for the lease drivers that. That this yeah. is the first that I heard that the full five thousand is paid out within the first year. That is, that is, wow. That that's a wow moment right there because the couple of trucking companies that I have personally talked to uh, a while back and they was offering ten grand, fifteen grand, and majority of that even on a small scale, it's not even paid out within the first year. It's paid out throughout years so when you mentioned that that's i was like wow okay so yeah that yep. okay your orientation go ahead yeah it's different for company and different for owner operators or okay. contractors okay and the lease purchase okay right and your owner operator or contractor services i should say let's put them all in one whether you're bringing your truck to us or leasing a truck through us okay right you do orientation completely separate your orientation is done in Egan, Minnesota. 
it's still the three day orientation. It still pays seventy five bucks a day. I'll still put you in a private room. I get your travel up there, but we want you to do it in Egan. That's the only place we hold or orientation, and that's for orient that's for owners or lease. Everybody else, company drivers, always go to Indianapolis or Birmingham. Okay. okay. So it's not just a separate orientation; it's a whole separate location. Okay. 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 We do that because we want you to meet with contractor services. That's where our corporate headquarters is located. Right. And that's where you're going to be talking to the people that you're working with. Okay. So you have a face with the name, and you can sit down and talk. Okay. 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 All right. So would the uh, would the would the uh, doing uh, orientation would I would I be in a would I be in a private room or would I have to share my room with somebody else? No, I, you know, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this at risk. I shouldn't say things like this. Oh, okay. I'll just put it this way: I don't sleep with strange people. You shouldn't either. Keep your own room. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Like you already, man. I like you already. All right. Well, hey, look. Uh, Dennis, thank you again for uh, taking the time to, to, to come back with me. Uh, I've written down everything. Uh, you said that you, let me see, email. Uh, let me see. <laughs> Did you, Dennis Wilson. Yeah, there you go. Okay, I got the information, Dennis. All right. Well, so I got another one for you, too. Oh, okay. So uh, the information that I got, I will definitely share it with uh with uh with the other drivers that uh that I know and that are interested in either the company side or the lease side. It sounds uh sounds sounds pretty good for for both. Um as I'm looking at the website, uh I, I click over to uh the company side, the solo side, uh it says here that you that you that you are starting CPM is fifty four cent a mile. Is that the uh, starting? No, no. No. Okay. What what is like the starting? Um, well it's all paid by experience. Four years. Four years? What four years company driver? Yes. Okay, you're just at just over where you at? Uh yeah, four years over. A little a little over. Yeah. Forty-seven cent a mile base. Okay. Okay. Three cents a mile performance pay. Eighty-five hundred gets you one cent. Ninety-five hundred miles gets you two pennies a month. Okay. And ten thousand five gets you three hundred or All three right. dollars, three cents a mile. All right. Okay. All right. And definitely, I'm looking at the I'm looking at the benefits. Definitely, the company drivers. Well, like they take advantage of uh, getting the benefits of uh, what the company has to offer. Unfortunately, the lease, I think she said, uh, I don't know if you mentioned it or if she mentioned it, but she said something that the lease drivers had to had to pay their own uh, medical health. They had to pay full, full medical health, dentist, I mean, uh, yes. dental, vision, all that yep. good stuff. Okay, okay. All right. Well, Dennis, man, again, thank you, thank you, thank you very much uh, for the time. Oh, do I, if I'm going to be a lease driver, do I have to have a uh, hazmat? No. Okay, okay. All right, cool, awesome. Well, that is it, Dennis. I got the information here uh, in my email. Thank you very much for sending that to me. I would definitely share this uh, within my Facebook group and uh, and in hey. my Twitter and in my Twitter group. So if anybody's interested in uh, getting with uh, Mr. Dennis, he would be the man to call. So I appreciate the anything time. Anything that Thank I can you. do, to, anything I can do to help, all you have to do is reach out. I I appreciate it. I appreciate it very much. Thank you, sir. And th and again, thank if you, you for thank uh, again, thank you for coming back. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, 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 uh. so thank well, you. You have a great day. All right, you Be too, safe sir. And holler if you need anything. I will. I will. Thank you very much, sir. And there you go. What do you guys think of that call? 
I mean, what do you guys think of that? I mean, wow, that that's that was a good guy, Dennis. Good guy, good information. He knows. Sounds like he knows his stuff. So if you guys interested in Transport America on their lease option side, definitely go to the website transportamerica.com and see what they got to offer. If you want information, more information about the company, you can definitely hit me up because I do have Dennis uh, direct contact and information. I was forwarded to you guys so that you guys could get, you know, to talk to him directly. You know what I'm saying? So if you're interested in lease, lease option, lease purchase, Transport America, I guess. All right. Well, that is it for this episode of Make the Call. So, again, let me know what you guys want in the comments below. Let me know who to call next in the comments below. But when you do that, make sure you give me some background about the company that you want me to call next all right if you have any questions yo questions give me some questions on what you want to know about these companies don't just have me to call them all right because i pretty much got canned questions what questions do you want you know what i'm saying what you what you want to know about felony you know what i'm saying you want to know about their trucks? What do you want to know? Let me know in the comments below. And until next time, next time, I am Lockout Men. I will talk to you guys later. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos like these, all right? Peace. You want to know about their trucks? What do you want to know? Let me know in the comments below. And until next time, next time i am lockout men i will talk to you guys later make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos like these all right peace